Hey you guys, it's Jen at Jen's Haunts and I had an opportunity today to start one of my jacks to go with my project for this year, 2018. So I just wanted to show you guys where I'm at. Let me see if I can show you some of the back here. Here's that. I started at about 10.30, it's now four. I, I think I put in about six hours into this guy. And last time you guys saw him, he was just paper mache. So next, um, when I get home this afternoon, I'll need to put paper mache on the bottom. And I put a cap on there with the piping and then you know that into the piece of the wood. The idea is that the cap will just come off. And that way, um, the pumpkin will just be released, and then I can put this one on there and start him and let this one dry. And then when it's all said and done, then I will take out the stuffing last. Um, but that won't be until um, I get the stem um, done, and I have some cool ideas for the stem. I'm going to have to take that apart and separate it in several pieces, and I'll go from there. So, um, of course, I always go to Unhinged Production when I'm doing any kind of sculpting like this. Um, I like Jay's recipe. I did change it a little bit to suit my needs. I was really trying to get this as smooth as possible. And um, so mine is one roll of toilet paper from Costco because, you know, some of them are huge and some of them are not. I soaked it in hot water for 10 minutes. I did a cup and a half of joint compound, a cup and a half of glue, one cup of flour, and four teaspoons of salt. And um, this is what I got. So the glue, um, when I first put it on, I will show you. I've got it in the bag, just like Jay says. Um, this is the texture that I get, which is pretty good. But then um, in, in watching um, Scalloween, Scalloween um, I used the brush and the water and um, went back over it and then smoothed it with my hands as well. And then if I wanted any lines, I just used um, one of these sticks, you know, for the shish kebabs. So this is where I'm at. I just wanted to share that with you. Um, I'll do another video next week and hopefully this one will dry. It'll probably take like 100 years to dry in front of a fan, but that's all right. I'm patient. I'll start this one anyways. And um, I will check back in with you guys next week and um, we'll go from there. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and I will talk to you later.